Yo, what's up guys? It's Crane for Days here. I am doing a video on how to use a GoWipe. I've trained a GoWipe and as you can see we're tied in war. I'm going to attack... Um, which one is it? Well, I'm going to attack 14. I just want to see what the percentages are. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be 14. So we're going to attack 14. It's, it's an easy base. But this is just a rundown and see how... To use a go what, um, what me what to made this make me use um do this video is my good old mate, C John. Well, his real name is Chris, but he's um got a YouTube channel. It's called um oh, I can't think right now. Um um I'll put it I'll put his name in the description, but. Um, go check him out. He does Clash of Clans videos, live videos on, I don't know what they are called, but yeah, they're good videos. Go check him out. Go subscribe. Um, so yeah, we how you train this thing, um, this attack strategy. This is what you should do if you're in a good donating clan, which I am because I've got awesome clan mates. Um, you can have it. The minimum you need for this way of attacking is is um one earthquake doesn't have to be it can be any level one earthquake in your clan castle three then you go one two three here then you go to your Alexia ones heal and a rage then you go two golems in your dark barracks if you want. You go that, and then you go, this is the way I do it, you could have it different. Then you have 6, 2, 1 in the one, like in three of them, and then in the one with your pecker, you put two peckers, three archers. So it's two peckers, three archers. And then in this one, and like all the others, it's six wizards, as you can see here. Six wizards, two wall breakers, and an archer in this one, and this one. Alright, so, alright, we've got walls finishing in 25 minutes, so we'll go attack and I'll show you how it works. Um, we'll go scout it so I can see what I'm doing, and I'll show you how do you do it. Alright, so you can see a big compartment right in this area that can be broken down with earthquakes. You want to sort of chuck that and pretty much that wall or that wall in between them or on that wall. And then then you start with a golem and then a golem. No, actually, since it's got clean castle troops, you put a archer down, lure them out to about like over here. And then take it out with the with the um, wizards and then archers. And then you go golem, golem, pecker, pecker. Then spread wizards all up at, at the top of here. You don't have to go all the way along, just like around here. And then um, and then yeah, you do heal like. Like, once you watch, you, you just heal your troops when you need it, and then rage it, probably, when they get to about the town hall. And then, yeah, and I'll show you how it goes. Alright, so, you go, earthquake, earthquake, earthquake. Then you... Yeah, and then we, I think that's all of them. Yeah, and then we lure them out. See if that takes care of him. Alright, so now. Yeah, golem, golem. Pekka, and then Pekka. Barb King. And then a line of wizards. And then just chuck your them in. Alright, then we'll 
rage it it's when they get to about there rage that this will be an easy um, three star it's just to give you a zest on how to use a go wipe and then use your king abil ability once it gets to just over halfway because then it will regen all the way up to about there and bring a couple of troops out so then they'll go up there and this wizard and this w couple of wizards will take out the rest of the buildings and that's how you do a go wipe um, this attack strategy is good for pushing um, but it's not really good for farming because it takes out it takes so much um, loot that's why I stopped pushing so now as we can see we're winning in clan war which is good mm, um, so this attack strategy took me to 2919 in masters 2 and I'm only a town hall um, 8 which is awesome And yeah, so that's how you use it. Um, other than that, peace out.